This video details a real application for tanker truck filling with chlorine mix. It was accomplished with an F124 ratio controller and an F131 batch controller. This application is designed to fill a tanker with a mix of 13.04% chlorine solution and water. The specific amount of each is programmed into the ratio controller. This F124 ratio controller monitors each line of flow using a pulse output flow meter and controls the ratio by controlling a proportional valve using a 4 to 20 milliamp output. The F131 controls the batch size by monitoring a flow meter input from the combined flow line and using relay outputs to a motor controller to drive the fluid pumps. Vacuum brakes are also included in the system to allow it to properly drain once the pumps are turned off after the batch is complete. The process begins when a new tanker truck arrives to be filled. The operator quickly sets the ratio controller to hand mode, allowing an output to be forced despite the lack of flow. This feature will prevent a lag in the addition of the additive, often seen in this sort of application, by forcing an initial state for the additive valve. Then, simply pressing the start button on the F131 batch controller will begin the process. Relay outputs on the F131 serve as digital inputs to the motor controller to begin running the pumps for both the chlorine and the water. A soft start slowly ramps up the rate of flow for both the chlorine and the water. The hand mode setting ensures the additive valve is open to allow a mix with the low flow of chlorine. This is useful if the slow start flow is too low to accurately be registered by the flow meters, or the pump activation is too fast for the ratio controller output to keep up with it on initial startup. As the flow rate increases, the operator changes the ratio controller back into ratio control mode. A bumpless transfer feature maintains the previously set ratio of 19.63%. From this point on, the ratio controller will adjust the analog output controlling the proportional valve to maintain this ratio based on the flow rate through flow line A, the chlorine feed line. As the pumps reach full speed, the entire system is now automated. The batch controller signals the pumps to be on, pumping approximately 135 gallons per minute of chlorine. The ratio controller sets the positioning valve in the water line to allow 26.5 gallons per minute of water into the mix line adjusting as needed for changes in chlorine flow. The batch controller totals the combined volume of flow going through the outlet flow meter, 161.5 gallons per minute, as it tracks the batch progress. Even at these speeds, it will take close to 45 minutes to fill this 7,000 gallon truck. Luckily, the system is now fully automated, with the F131 displaying how much mixture has been batched. The user is now free to bring his attention elsewhere while the system completes its batch process. Just before the truck is filled and the batch complete, the batch controller turns off its relays and deactivates the pumps. It does this using its overrun correction feature and knowledge of past inaccuracies of running this batch. This activates the vacuum brakes and the fluid remaining in the system already past the pumps can drain into the truck. As the last flow drains into the truck, the full 7,000 gallons has been accurately dispensed. The batch controller knows from past batches that an overrun was expected and automatically calculated the overrun cutoff time, turning off the relays just early enough that this excess flow would be counted in the batch process. With the 7,000 gallon batch complete and accurate, this truck's ready to roll. The system's reset, just as it was when this process started, ready to fill the next truck as it arrives. For more information on fluid well ratio and batch controllers, or any precision digital display and control solution, visit us online at predig.com.